years old. I'm from Uzbekistan, it's Tashkent. I'm an artist. Uh, I graduated the Singaporean University. My motto was like uh, industrial management, but I decided to become an artist because it was my hobby and I uh, really love to draw. Uh, the first time uh, when I'm in China and I really fell in love with uh, China because uh, I admire that the Chinese people keep their tradition uh, and foundation. It's really wonderful. I love it. A couple of months ago I decided to learn Chinese uh, and it's a great chance to know the culture, to know the uh, everything from China. I was super excited about uh, the pottery classes because I was participated in my countries. When I got a base like a stress base or something like when I think in a lot, uh, I can draw. And this is the same. I relax with doing these things. One of the best feelings is that you create something by your hands. It's really cool. I think it's similar. You're doing something with your hands and it's really important. In my country, there are a lot of talented uh, young people who make an art. Even if you are not interested in art, I mean, if you are not even want to be like an artist or the musician, you have to do it just because, especially, it, it makes me feel like I'm doing something with my hands, with my, by myself. It's a really good feeling. Even, even they can solve the problems or uh, about the business through the uh, I think through the art you can solve the problem about the business because you have to uh, think in a little bit in a different way. I think this is one of the one of the um, great things what people can do. The art they are expressing their their selves. It's the way how they can uh, stress out uh, and this helps to become a little bit happier. I think art is the universal language, like uh, everybody uh, who doing the art, they um, like expressing their self, their culture, their ideas, and um, this is the unique, this is the, like everybody doing the unique um, art. I think uh, through the art we can communicate with the whole world. I think the Belt and Road, uh, it's a great idea that China can offer because uh, it, it helps to communicate the countries with each other, it helps to improve the economic uh, situations, it helps to make better the trade between the countries. I think it's really great. I want to know the better the culture, the better the people who come from uh, the different countries, what participated in the Silk Road. And then when I will come back to my country, I want to influence on heritage these important issues.